Hello everyone, today I'll be sharing with you a simple optimization process to significantly reduce the overall file size of a website when preparing it for migration. This optimization process is also recommended for those who occasionally back up their website after making significant changes to it. The reason for this optimization is that WordPress has a built-in feature that auto-saves versions of changes made to a site's posts, pages, and other dynamic content hosted within its database, in addition to those manually saved when we hit the Save Draft, Update, or Publish button. While these stored revisions can be a good thing for an admin to revisit when the need arises to undo or redo changes, over time, these revisions can result in a bloated website. So the more revisions you create, the more cluttered your database becomes, potentially impacting the overall website's performance. This can result in longer loading times, ultimately leading to a negative user experience and lowering your site's search rankings. So making it a habit of occasionally managing these revisions is crucial for maintaining optimal website performance. While there are several ways to accomplish this task, I'll be showing you a rather simple method to optimize your site's database using an optimization plugin, which, of course, you can choose to delete afterward. Now let's open up our site's backend to add a new plugin. Search for WP Optimize and then install to activate. Upon activation, navigate to the plugins menu within the admin dashboard and select Database. Before we get started with running the optimizations, it's recommended that you take a backup of your site before proceeding. Once you've taken a backup, let's proceed with running the selected optimizations. Once done, you can go ahead to perform another website backup to compare their sizes. I thought to share this with some of us who are unaware that this happens in the background, so keep this at the back of your mind the next time you wish to take a website backup or simply prepare it for a migration. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next one.